we've all got the Friday night fever. One of our favorite parts about Friday is Friday night football fever. It's not going to kick off until 10 15 tonight, but right now we've got the Lowndes Academy Rebels here in the studio. This is head coach Shane Boy, along with Waters Vox and Halen itself. I told you I almost hated to talk about your incredible season, undefeated season. I don't want to jinx it for you, but we have to talk about the fact that you've gone 26 games so far undefeated. What an incredible record. What's happening there? No, I mean, it's just awesome. we got a bunch of group of kids that just continue to want to win. And after 2021, when we won a state title, just continue to roll over to each class. And, you know, we gra graduated 10 seniors from last year's season, so we didn't know how it would go in experience. And uh, they just picked right up where they left off, and it's been fun to be a part of it. Can I ask you, like, what's the secret? What's your winning secret? What are you, what are you doing? All the coaches around the state are wanting to know. <laughs> no, it's not. I mean, it's just we got good players, and I got a great staff that continues to get the best out of these kids, and they work hard, and they just want to continue the tradition. And these boys just, you know, they said we didn't want to rebuild. We want to just reload and continue, continue on the winning way. So Yeah, maybe I should ask Waters what's the secret. What is it about this team that's such a great winning combination? I mean, we just bond as a team, so we – Keep going and rebuild and not reload. Yeah, rebuild and not reload, or reload and not yeah, rebuild yeah, is what you said. Right. Yes. I, Haylin, you're the, uh, the cheer captain yes, for the cheerleading squad. Obviously, you've had a lot to cheer yes, <laughs> lately. That makes it a little bit easier to prepare, but I know you guys put in so much work to get ready. Talk a little bit about the excitement, the Friday Night Lights excitement. Yes, the environment, it's, it's really amazing. It's just been really cool to watch us make history these past three years. It's, um, you know, it's always fun to cheer for a winning team, and I hope it stays that way for the rest of the season. But, yeah, the environment's always great. I guess so. It is fun to cheer for a winning team, but it's fun to cheer for the team even when things aren't quite going your way. And I know you guys put in a lot of work. What does it take to get ready for a football season? Well, it's, it is a lot of work, but it's, it's fun when you really care about the team. And this school has always been great with cheering for, you know, each other. And the boys come and support us in our sports and our cheer competition. So it's, it's really easy to give back and support them because we want to see them win just like we want to win. All right, you're heading to Crenshaw tonight. Can you give us any, any insight on what we can expect to see from tonight's game? Uh, we're excited. It's for the region championship, so it's a big game and it's going to be a great atmosphere. Um, hopefully we can get it done. It'll be our fourth region championship in a row. Um, so we got a good plan, and we're excited to hopefully execute it and take care of business. And Waters and Haylin, you guys are both seniors. What's next for y'all? Uh, hopefully get a scholarship for kicking. Um, but if that doesn't work out, I'll hopefully work at the family business and be an aircraft mechanic. Okay. Wow. What about you, Haylin? Hopefully I'll be at Alabama next year. That's, that's the plan. <laughs> well, good luck to both of you next year. Good luck to you and your team tonight. Incredible, incredible record. We hope to see that just that streak continue. 26 games and counting is what I'm saying.